My name is Mr. 2020. And I'm Victoria. Oh my God. <laughs> Welcome to another exciting, feel it real, exciting, feel it real fun episode number 808. I'm so glad she remembers these things. In because 80, it will be 888. Oh my and God. That's really uh, and, lucky. And we'll do choice. it at 88, 8 o'clock. Okay? <laughs> okay. Just for fun. In eight minutes past eight. Oh, 8, 8, 8 o'clock. Oh. oh. All right. Anyway, right. <laughs> Blondie, wasn't Debbie Harry hot, Joe? Like, seriously, we remember the good old day. Right. Who's that other one? Oh, Paula Abdul, you Paula love. Abdul. Ow. Oh, yeah. You love that one. Okay. So, Episode uh, number 808. All right. And Believe it or not, it's about the secret of the, the senses. senses. Oh, my God. Can you imagine? That's why we bring up stuff like Debbie Harry and Paula Abdul. Mm. Oh. Yeah. So, oh. <laughs> by the way, it's Neville's triple whammy meets triple your income. Maybe we put that in the title. Triple. Neville's triple whammy meets triple your income. Meets triple your income. Yeah, so I, I got a little the bored. Title of the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I've got to right. remember that. That's right. Okay. <laughs> All right. So. Meanwhile, I've got a free Neville.com. That's right. Join us in manifestingmasterycourse.com. That's right. Unless you and, want to go slow. Yeah. And for refunds, go to feelitrealfun.com. That's right. So we've got the Neville secret got of the senses. Right. Neville got a quote. Here's yeah. what I'm doing. No, 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 right there. If your income. All right, okay. so listen close. Yes. <laughs> the voice of Victoria is going to do Neville. <laughs> and it's fun. from The Secret of the Senses, but the show is all about. What did you say it was? It's Neville's triple whammy meets triple your income. Right. Okay. That's right, Keith. If your income had just been increased to say, well, he says 30 grand a year, so maybe we'll add a zero for our time 300 grand a year. From your present income of less than ten grand, how would you feel? By the way, to the lady that says Neville never said to double your income, you're right. <laughs> he gave this as an example, so guess what? <laughs> it's tripling it's a, it. It's okay. Yeah. Take a deep breast. <laughs> breast. <laughs> okay. Humor. It's a good thing. How would your present circle of friends see you? Would they know it? Would they discuss it? Would they speak? of the change in your life. Tell them and then eavesdrop and hear your friends discuss you as one who is now making 30 grand, 300 grand a year. Yeah, triple your old income. By the way, notice mm. what Neville says. He doesn't say hide. Don't let, because he, he starts out with like, would they know? What would they say? Yeah, yeah. And, and, and I know a lot of people go, oh, well, like it, it, money makes me uncomfortable. And yeah. so it's religion and <laughs> veganism. And that's a religion based on money as well. <laughs> so we're going to hide and never talk about food or fun or sex or money or anything. No one would congratulate me because I'm terrified of my friends that they'll leave me if I triple my income. Mm. Right? Oh, my God. But what does Neville say? Tell them. Yeah. Right. You know what? An eavesdrop. Yep. Tell them like an that. eavesdrop. You know, it's like, <laughs> hey, you know what? We just, yeah, <laughs> we just tripled our, anyway, yes. right. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> Testosterone. Now, yes. <laughs> Victoria. Yes. Get how cool this is. Now, there's a formula in here. It's, we call it the triple whammy. Say it with me. Everybody the ready to, wherever you're whammy. watching this from, type in the words triple and whammy. And uh, whammy would be with an H. <clears throat> with a WH, a silent H. Exactly. Whammy. <laughs> whammy. I love that. Whammy. Whammy. <laughs> whammy. So, okay. Victoria. Yes. All right, so we got a little bit more uh, to read. Oh, sorry. Oh, do we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got more. Oh, absolutely. Oh, so, wow. Now, here's the comment. Ready? Notice how Neville deepens your state. We did a whole week's training exploring this from the coolest ways. Not necessarily this way, but this way included. But we really nailed this whole triple whammy thing in some cool ways. But I want you to start on this in a basic way right now. Ready? Mm. Where'd it was go? it going? No, it's up here. Yeah, right there. Would they know it? Okay, would they know it? Neville says, would your friends know it? Mm. I don't know. Would they? I mean, let's play a game called, whenever you're not bitching about the price of petrol and peanut butter, your friends will notice there's a difference. Right? Let's mm. take a side note. If Cube quit complaining about the price of petrol, would yes. they notice? Yeah. Absolutely. Like an hour's I worth of my week would be free. Yeah, what would he talk about <laughs> besides the price of petrol? <laughs> yes. Would they discuss it? Yeah, right now we are. So we just imagine a uh, cube triple his income. Or he's yeah. not mentioning what's the price of petrol. What oh, are we the doing? the price to go to the leisure center. <laughs> yeah, see, now we're talking about it on the show. <laughs> right. Meanwhile. Would they, and wait, would they speak of the change in your life? To total strangers, hundreds of them. Yeah, you right? should see cube now. <laughs> oh, he's a good oh. right to be around. Boom. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he ever watches the show. I know, I'm going to tell him. <laughs> okay. So, Get how cool this is, guys. Yeah. And that last little bit that I didn't include in the article where Neville says, tell them an eavesdrop. Yep. In other words, don't hide. 
one of the things that we noticed that keeps people stuck from having a dream-driven day, and I'm going to you know, go back to Victoria and I, right? She used to do this thing called a J-O-B. Yeah. Yep, should go to it like eight hours a day. Should leave like 10 minutes after she should have started and get I back <laughs> like an hour and a half after she should have quit, right? Because she <laughs> felt bad about getting there 10 minutes late, right? That's true. You did, right? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's just call it the way it is. And I just sit here, right? Now, here's the thing. I was building the empire, mm. right? But I didn't have a J-O-B. I didn't drive nowhere. I didn't even have a car for the first year. Didn't care. No. Didn't want one. Yes. But here's the thing. Should it be close to her coming home and I go, fuck, man, I better like... Start working. Let's do some dishes or <laughs> no. something, right? So what'd you do today? The dishes, right? Now, this is important because let's say you double your income and you work half the time or you triple your income and work a third of the time, mm. right? I like doubles because it, it's easier to process biologically, right? Yeah. But if you doubled your income and worked half the time, mm. a lot of people think, well, like my friends won't like me, right? Oh, well, my friends might abandon me, mm. right? My friends would be maybe jealous or hate me or... Now, let's be honest, okay? Almost, Some might not like you anymore. <laughs> all, almost all of my friends do work 40 hours a week or so, hmm. right? I'm not thrilled with that. Yeah. But here's the thing, right? Do I still have them? Yeah. Are they happy for me? Yeah. Do they want to learn? Yeah. Some of them do. Yeah. Some of them are going, well, I can't wait to get my next 40-hour week job going by what I went to university for, and then I'll hate doing that. It's like, oh, that'll be good fun, won't it? Right? <laughs> Yeah. But notice what Neville does here. He just doesn't say, I'm imagining having tripled my income. No, he goes through a couple questions here to get it to deepen. Right? Mm. Who gives a if, if they don't like me anymore, says Joe. Well, you're from New Jersey. <laughs> no, let, let, Let's take a vote. Does anybody here like New Jersey? Oh, right? no, I'm we sorry. love people We love New Joe, Jersey. but let's say, is, yeah, well, is New Jersey like your favorite street? Like, like <laughs> I remember waking up in the morning as a little boy every day, I'd be going, I want to go to New Jersey. Uh, all right, it's not that sort of place, isn't no, it? No, it's, it's not okay. like Texas or sorry, California <laughs> or something like that or right. Nebraska, right? <laughs> yeah. You've got two friends in Nebraska. So, uh, <laughs> anyway. It's a bouncy place. So, yeah. <laughs> right? See, boom, boom, boom. Yasmin says, now that's when you have even more fun with friends. Yeah, when they end up working, when they quit working, right? This is the good fun. But you're never going to get there until you deepen your experience. And the kicker for me with this is the whole thing is where Neville says, tell them. Because I know a lot of people are going, I, I wouldn't tell my friends. I mean, they wouldn't notice. <laughs> I wouldn't notice. <laughs> right? So I'm now driving around. And <laughs> yeah, believe me, they'll notice. Yeah. Right? And so just get rid of that closet fear. That's the thing. You've got to get rid of the closet fear. Mm. This is why congratulatory conversations are so cool. Mm. Right? Because it implies that your friends still like you. Right? <laughs> they're not only liking you, they're happy for you. Yeah, Victoria, you're doing great. I mean, like, I mean, what the fuck does she do on it? She never leaves the house. Could we go to the dog park and yoga? Right? <laughs> the yoga. Right? And occasionally the power walk with Yasmin Maxwell. Right? Oh, we well, have to start back up in that. That's right. <laughs> I don't know about that one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What does that even mean? I don't even know. <laughs> Triple whammy, guys. Play with those three questions. Victoria will say them one more time. If you're smart and watching this on a refund someplace sometime, yeah. right? type these three in. Yes. Right? Seriously. One. Yeah, put these in the comments. Wherever you're watching this now, stop it. Stop it. Except for live. <laughs> stop it yeah, now. Stop it now and type in the comments or okay. the, the three questions, which the three are. three questions are, would they know it? Would they know it? Would they discuss it? Would they discuss it? Would they speak of the change in your life? Bonus points if you write down what Neville said after that in the quote that we will link to in the. I like the last bit, actually, what Neville said. What did Neville say, Victoria? Tell <laughs> him, said, tell him. Tell him. <laughs> tell him. <laughs> and then eavesdrop. That's right. I love oh, it. Oh, oh. <laughs> what are they saying about me? <laughs> yeah. And yeah. then what can I make it mean? <laughs> what can I make it mean? By the way, yeah. <laughs> so for my friends that still are trying to like, decide what to do, and, 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 and I, I remember when I put up our first Kindle book, Victoria, uh, and a hater came along. Right? Neville got it simplified. I believe so. Oh, uh, yeah. And a hater came along. Oh. And you know what I said? Mm. I went, oh, let's give this the attention it deserves. And then we started winding things in. Okay, we'll be nice. <laughs> Seriously, as long as you're afraid of what other people think, you will not be able to effectively use congratulatory conversations. But if you play with congratulatory conversations, you're going to discover something different. 
Tall poppy syndrome. Tall poppy syndrome. Oh my god. Yep. <laughs> Let's hear from our Australians. <laughs> Australians. <laughs> yep. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. Oh, we're playing the color game. This is great. Are they? Okay. <laughs> Orange. 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 Right. Orange. <laughs> work out what I want an orange aluminium helicopter. Orange. An orange aluminium helicopter. <laughs> Why would you want that? <laughs> just for fun. <laughs> all right. All right. So, so I hope you wrote all that in. Would they know it? Would they discuss it? Would they speak of the change in your life? Yep. Write these things down. Right. If you don't want to do it for you, do it for us. Because. Uh, yeah. I'd like, like seriously, like uh, 500 comments, or I'm sorry, 500 views, three comments. It's like one of those things that makes me depressed. Like, yeah. Yeah, I get depressed. <laughs> I don't look like I get depressed. Cool. Really. All right, so, so what we want you to we, do. We want you to do these things. I want you to tell us, tell type us. in below, what did you learn? What did you learn about you? And what was your best bit? Oh, uh, look, it's a semi-auto. It's a semi-auto. <laughs> Meanwhile, back at the French. Go to friendnever.com. Get on a 2-to-1 email list. Right? It's that little pseudo-random article you get every day that'll give heaps to you. Yeah. But if yes. you really want to go to med school and be a doctor, right? Manifesting go Mastery to manifestingmasterycourse.com. That's right. And for refunds, go to feelitrealfun.com. That's right. Cool. Oh, my God. Victoria, was that lovely? Just in time, I'd Just say. Just in time. All right. Hear the noise? Yep. I used to know a fellow named Just in Case. <laughs> yeah, you said <laughs> Man, you really did. I don't know I really did. That. I'll show him to you. Okay. He's on Facebook. All right. Doesn't mean he was Catch a us tomorrow. Of That's right. Freenable.com. <laughs> What's that? I don't know what it is. Is that Ron doing something? I don't know. Maybe he's building me finally his cupboard. <laughs> <laughs>